Hi Dora, I have something to tell you. Oh hi there little Bill, what is something that you wanted to tell me? King Tyler San, Kia Walter, and Plankton invited us to see the Loud House movie. Do you want to join? Of course. Why not? When they arrived at Vine Stadium and Movie Theater. So King Tyler San, Kia Walter! Oh, are you going ready for the Loud House movie with Dora and Little Bill? Born Ready Plankton. I hope Dora and Little Bill arrived at the theater, and here they are now, guys. Hello, Hello there, there, King, King Tyler San, Kia Walter, Walter and, Plankton. and Plankton. I did Dora and Little Bill. We have some special guests coming in for the Loud House movie. Awesome. Who the heck are the special guests? Well, we'll see about that. So, let's go to the ticket manager for the movie. It's, these are the special guests, Mephiles and Mechagodzilla. Hello, I'm Mephiles and I'm Shagodzilla. Hello, Hello there, there. Mechagodzilla and, and Mephiles. Good to see you. So, Mephiles, King Talasan, and Mephiles can wiggle there he is. Yeah, you see, it's Mephiles, King Talasan. And Kai Walton wiggle the ass, little boys. Wiggle your ears. Well, I will go on to see him. Alright then, Gus, look at her as wiggle. It's so awesome. Wow, boys. That's an awesome and cute air wiggle. Yeah. I agree with Dora. Why, thanks. So, let's watch the movie right now. It's starting. It's one of the most beloved animated classics of all time. I wish I was a boy. But that's another movie. <laughs> Oh, you're hurting me, dear blue fairy. How many times I gotta tell you, dog breath? I ain't no fairy! Walt Disney Pictures presents Teacher's Pet, the musical tale of one dog's dream of becoming a boy. A boy needs a dog. He's a boy. He's a boy. He's a dog. Teacher's pet. Oh, he's good. I wish I had a nickel for every time I've heard that. Sunday morning values, Saturday morning fun. Veggie Tales always delivers a healthy serving of both. It's shut down! With toe tapping music. Stand up, stand up. For what you believe in, believe in. An infectious silliness. You're a tough. Weed. I'm a talking weed. You're a talking carrot. The point was... The entire VeggieTales library is fortified with fantastic values. You're special just the way God made you. More than 20 critically acclaimed videos are now available on VHS or on DVDs packed with great bonus features for the whole family. Have I ever steered you wrong? A shopaholic blueberry. Your kingdom awaits. An inventive gray. Rocket power. That's the way it's gonna go. A fearless asparagus. I will fight the lion. Even a king with a thing for rubber duckies. Now go and get that duck. It's a cast of characters that has put smiles on millions of faces. Hey, desperados, you better come to your senses. And the timeless lessons of the Bible in millions of hearts. I laughed. I cried. It moved me, Bob. Check out the entire veggie catalog at BigIdea.com to find the episodes you need to add to your collection. The SpongeBob SquarePants DVD collection is available now. This 
will prove to be my greatest evil scheme ever. Let the mauling begin. Over and over, I hit my head on some blocks. Now I can't seem to remember anything. What am I gonna do without my best friend? I SpongeBob SquarePants DVD collection is available now. Each sold separately. And look out for more SpongeBob DVDs coming soon. <laughs> Calling all cartoon connoisseurs. Still holding Mr. Schwarzenegger? Stay on the line. Still there, Mr. Eastwood? Please hold. Look for Animaniacs Volume 1 on DVD. Did you missiles? The next generation of classic animation. Hello? Yes! It's coming to DVD for the first time ever. How's that for an entrance? Yes, the famous Warner Brothers. And the Warner sister. Yakko, Wacko, and Dot have been released. Be afraid. Be very afraid. Now experience the liberated loonies and their super crazy croonies. On a five-disc DVD collection filled with 25 hilarious episodes from the hit TV show. I feel so at home here. That no animation aficionado should miss. But wait, there's more. Then prepare for global domination by an unstoppable force. We are two lab mice involved in a broad and sweeping plan to take over the world. <laughs> Pinky in the Brain, Volume 1 on DVD. Yes, these ruthless rodents are exposing their mad genius in a devious four-disc collection on DVD. Ergo, instant celebrity. With 22 outlandish episodes from the award-winning TV series. God, my brilliant! Plus, special behind-the-scenes bonus features too powerful to resist. So surrender your sanity with two new collections on DVD. Now it's time for the hard sell. Steven Spielberg presents Animaniacs and Pinky and the Brain, both available for the first time ever. Goodbye, nurse! I like square butts and I cannot lie. Squid and sea star can't deny. When a sponge walks in four corners and his pants like he got phone book implants, the crowd shouts. All the ladies stare. Hey, those pants are square. Swinging through the seaweed tangles is a butt with short right angles. Now, yeah, SpongeBob, I wanna get with ya, cause you're making me rich ya. Burger King wants me to seal the deal. 99 cent, get a toy and a kid's meal. Booty is booty. Buy an adult value meal and get a BK Kids meal with a SpongeBob toy for just 99 the standard girl and the classic bunk bed. Learn these techniques and more as Mike and Sally teach you the following fur raising scare. Get your scare on. Rated E for everyone. October is National Movie Month, when the best of the newest movies will be shown at your favorite theater. Join the world and share the romance, color, adventure, hilarity, excitement, and splendor that spell movies during National Movie Month. Be here in October. It's National Movie Month. Jim Rex? What's Jim Rex? Would you believe a movie audience guide presented as a public service by this theater's management to help you select your motion picture entertainment? Well, that's what it is. And we urge you to learn these rating symbols and use them as a guide for you and your family. G means suggested for general audiences, all ages. M, suggested for mature audiences, parental discretion advised. R, restricted, persons under 16 not admitted unless accompanied by parent or adult guardian. X, persons under 16 will not be admitted. This seal in advertising indicates that the film was approved under the Motion Picture Code of Self-Regulation.
All right, name the town. I'll be on my way in the morning. What? Nineveh? You don't want me to go there. In a land of mystery. <laughs> Nineveh! It's the other end of the world! <laughs> in a town full of trouble. Nineveh, the biggest, meanest city around. Those people do not know right from wrong. It's up to one reluctant asparagus. You are a Jonah. You are a big shot. I have the Jonah plush toy. With the help of some fearless friends. We are the pirates who don't do anything. Oh, you'll know that's right. Nothing. Zilch. Nada. Oh, lovely. To go where no vegetable has dared to go. We got trouble. You are, you are... Fishboom. Big Idea Productions presents... Ah! Archibald Asparagus. Bob the Tomato. Oh, dear. Larry the Cucumber. Perhaps I can be of assistance. Oops. And introducing... A caterpillar named Khalil. That is only half true. My mother was a caterpillar. My father was a worm. But I am okay with that now. They may be fresh. Ah, they're a fresh when we cut them. <laughs> they may be feisty. Didn't I tell you to get off my ship, you lousy leaf eater? File one! But soon, they may be lunch. <laughs> Jonah, a Veggie Tales movie. This fall. Only in theaters. It is very delightful, but I must go now. Once upon a time that hasn't happened yet, there will be a spaceship called the Infinity. And steering the Infinity among the heavenly bodies will be the most heavenly body of them all, called Galaxina, a dream machine, transistorized and computerized to lead her space buddies across the farthest reaches of fantastic adventure with class. Venusian Thunder Ripple, 2001, a great year. Great. Galaxina, the beautiful. Galaxina, the untouchable. <laughs> Galaxina, the Invincible. She cleans. She cooks. Chicken. She does windows and more. I've adjusted my temperature. I'm better than a human woman. What year is it? 3035. I got 3,033. This thing's slow. It's party time on the planets with the beautiful people of the intergalactic jet set. <laughs> well, at least you're not two-faced. Well, you wouldn't have chosen the one you've got on. Tension to the fourth dimension as they dodge death rays across the universe. Good guys. Bad guys. Nice aliens. Mommy! Okay. <laughs> Nasty aliens. The name is Mr. Spot. Galaxina. Starring Stephen Mock, Avery Schreiber, James David Hinton, and introducing Dorothy R. Stratton, Playboy's Playmate of the Year, as your favorite gal, Galaxina. <laughs> I love love stories, don't you? Once upon a time, in a land far, far away. She's a funny little squirt. A very small girl, no bigger than a thumb. I wish I were big. Don't ever wish to be anything but what you are. And an impossible dream of finding her one true love. Let me be your only love. Well, then ever after. But before her fairy prince could claim her heart. She's gonna marry the fairy prince. Well, perhaps. 
she was stolen from her home. Somebody in the sky. Who did it? A toad. And lost to a very big world. I'll find her. You are going to marry my son? Oh, no, no, no. Thumbelina! I hear that she loves the fairy prince, right? Are you really going to marry the fairy prince? Yes. <laughs> well, then follow your heart. It will lead you home. Yeah. From the enchanting pages of Hans Christian Andersen's storybook classic and the imagination of Don Bluth, director of an American tale, comes a magical ride in a world brought to life by the music of Barry Manilow. Oh, Thumbelina. I love great romances. Thumbelina. Nothing is impossible if you follow your heart. A lovely story. They called him Elegant John, and he was one heck of a trucker. Like all truckers, he had a dream. I worked all my life. I've driven all across the country. All I want to do is make one last run. One last perfect run carrying load all the way across the country. And elegant John was going to make that dream come true, even if it meant breaking through. The Great Smoky Roadblock, in a stolen truck filled with ladies of dubious background and doubtful reputation. Elegant John set out on the wildest cross-country trailer truck chase in the history of the American highway. Two more states and we are home free. Sometimes there was a little detour. My God! But there's more than one way to skin a possum. Leave me alone now. You leave me alone. I'm, I'm married. Ain't nobody that married. If you know what I mean. The Great Smoky Roadblock stars Henry Fonda. Bad cowboy. You get in my way again, I'll kill you. You hear me? Eileen Brennan. You will never take us alive. The smoking marijuana would make you crazy. John Viner as crazy Bobby Appers. Dub Taylor. And Dana House as Celeste Lay. Fasten your seatbelts, turn on that CV, and get ready for the death-defying ride of a lifetime. Get ready for the ride that would forever abolish the Great Smoky Roadblock. It's the fanciest trucking you've ever seen. dawn of man to the magnificence of the Bible. The Lord Jehovah has given unto you these fifteen, ten, ten commandments. From the glory that was Rome uh, to the dark evils of the Spanish Inquisition. For now begins the Inquisition. Oh, you to the French Revolution with its squalor and its splendor. The peasants may grow violent. They are my people. I am their sovereign. I love them. Paul! History of the World, Part 1, starring... It's good to be the king. More women! More wine! More! I and submit to the king. Last one. Oh, that's left. Oh! You beautiful way. Stop it. <laughs> Let's end this meeting on a high note. Hey, what country are you from? Ethiopia. What part? 
On 25th Street. Oh. I'm Miriam. I'm a Vestal Virgin. I'm really sorry to hear that. You should have been here over 30 grains ago. Please manage me. Gee, I just ate. Drama. Do you require a blindfold? None. Have you any last words? None. Test the guillotine. Hold. Action. Where are you going? I don't know. Romance. Say when. 8.30. Spectacle. The Inquisition. What a show. We know you're wishing that we go away. But the Inquisition's here and it's here to stay. Mel Brooks. History of the World. Part 1. Ten million years in the making. Maybe I should just try the first line until you're sure that the attitude's right. I think we need to start laying him down. Okay, let's try that. John Cleese, 22, take one. We are paying this respected professional. Any more comments before I start running? To act like a fraud. <laughs> How do I get myself talked into these things? A frog who thinks he's a prince. Voila! They call me your Johannes. Trying to save a swan. Hold on. To the rescue, mademoiselle. A swan who's really a princess. Princess of death. And that's just for starters. <laughs> The Swan Princess, featuring the voices of John Cleese. Sure, go on, John Dobb, race to your death. Sandy Duncan. No, it can't be. Jack Balance. Had to be sneaky, didn't you? And Stephen Wright. No, 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 no. In a fresh spin on a classic fairy tale. Dead. Derek. A magical musical animated adventure. The Swan Princess. The secret of a successful beer is advertising! That makes sense. You are about to enter the dynamic, high-pressured world of advertising. You're all yes men. Whenever I ask you a question, you're always going to say yes. What good is that? I need men who will tell me what they think. Am I right, Reamer? Yes. You fight. Get up. Don't look back. Press the down button. Here, creative people team up to exchange brilliant ideas. Ideas that will influence everything from what we drive. Okay, honey, do your stuff. To what we put in our mouths. I don't like it. All right, then picture this, and how about this? Lawyer cans. I hate it. Smythe, you're the uh, creative director. Uh, you got anything you can uh, throw out at us here? We get a bunch of guys. They work for construction. And after a hard day's work, they reach for some Norbecker beer. They all reach for a beer. Each one gets a beer. Then they hold them up. Hi. You're fired. Get out. Mr. Femer. Yes. Miss Tucker, what does the lady executive have to say? I'm putting together a concept. And now, you're about to experience more drama. I will smash Anakin. And more action than you've ever expected. In a light comedy. When me and my buddies are drinking Norbecker Pilsner, we don't like being disturbed. No, Becca Pills. Have one. If you're tough enough. I want macho. What has beer got to do with being a man? Alcoholism, divorce, violence in the streets. We're doing great. You pick the right kind of guys for this sort of thing. Me and my buddies. Case of Nora Becker and let nature take its course. Commercial over yet, guys? 
most commercials. Come on, fellas. They are disgusting. They are degrading. Or are they? Let's find out. I just try to make a living like everybody else. So come on, guys. Without you know I'm Beer. The funniest movie ever to come out of a bottle. When you hear your name called, I want you to go over to Coach Butts and I want you to pick up your jersey. Those jerseys are so cool. For everyone who has waited to be chosen. Lewis! Yeah! But is still waiting. Rivera! Rivera! For everybody who has dreamed of being somebody. Scanlon! But is still dreaming. Walker! For every person who only wanted that one chance. For the rest of you. But never got it. I'd like to thank you for trying out. Your day has come. Let's kick some butt. Are you ready for a miracle? You killed the mice, Fox. Look, you berserk old Barbie doll. You can talk the talk, you walk the walk. Somebody call 911! Warner Brothers and Emblem Entertainment present... Where in the hell do you get off trying to put together another team? Guys like you and... Kids like that. I mean, they can't help it. They're no good. Rick Moranis. Who are you, Vince Lombardi all of a sudden? It's Pee Wee Football. Ed O'Neill. Oh, my God. Coach is a vampire. Peanut butter and jelly sandwich? You'll never get anywhere treating your helmet like a lunchbox, son. And a cast of small wonders. Timmy, I'm not sure, but I don't think that goes there. In the story of a gridiron miracle. League rules clearly state one town, one team. Meet me at half court. It's the 50-yard line, Dad. Now, with a little professional help... They've got exactly two weeks to learn how to pass. Are you yeah! What a hunk. Hi. Catch. Son, if you're going to cheat, win. Block. Get the fear out of your eyes. Let's go. Yeah! You got to make And kick butt. Want intimidation? I'll show you intimidation. Little Giants. Do you like football? No. You want to play football? No. Great, you can be on our team. Heroes come in all sizes. Deep beneath the world's greatest ocean lives a sponge unlike any other. For years, he enjoyed a carefree life. Hey! Who blew this bubble? But all that was about to change. By tomorrow, I will rule the world! Hey! <laughs> well, good luck with that. My crown! Someone has stolen the royal crown! Who can stop me now? <laughs> you, be back here with my crown in exactly ten days. You can do it in nine, eight, seven, six, seven, four, five, six it is then. Now, what is it? The paddy wagon. Sesame seed finish. Steel belted pickles. And under the hood? Wow. Yeah. Wow. He will begin a journey to become the hero he was born to be. Are they laughing at us? No, Patrick. They're laughing next to us. This November. Hooray for SpongeBob! Get ready. Let's get it out! Go for big adventure. Oh, boy. <laughs> How you doing? Trouble. Things have gotten a lot worse since you left. Plankton's turned everyone we know into slaves. Even Gary. Oh, Plankton. Big twists. Oh, my gosh, Patrick, you have a mustache. So do you. Oh. 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 Big action. Big surprises when Sponge meets World. Who are you? I'm David Hasselhoff. For the very first time. Hooray! The SpongeBob SquarePants movie. Run! <laughs> <laughs> 
20th Century Fox invites you to take an advanced peek at the biggest holiday event of 1994. Starring Macaulay Culkin as you've never seen him before. In the world of Richard Tyler, danger is everywhere. Ah! Look, yeah. it's Richard Tyler. Go for it, Tyler. What's wrong? You scared? Hey, Rich, come on up. Solid as a rock. 8% of all household accidents involve ladders. Another 3% involve trees. We're looking at 11% probability here. Go down to Gutman's hardware store, buy a pound of nails. We're going to finish this treehouse before dark if it kills us. Under the rain and into a place where imagination runs wild. Welcome, young man. The library card, please. I don't have one. You do now. Get ready for the adventure of a lifetime with the Page Master. I'm a cartoon. You are an illustration. Ah! Right now, he's only a drawing, while the most magical film of 1994 is in production. The Featuring the voices of Whoopi Goldberg. Oh, baby. Patrick Stewart. Ah, I ain't afraid of nothing. Frank Welker from Aladdin. <laughs> Leonard Nimoy. Dr. Jekyll? Yes, sir. And Christopher Lloyd. I am the Page Master. Producer David Kirshner, who brought you an American tale, Once Upon a Forest, and Hocus Pocus, joins director Joe Johnston of Honey, I Shrunk the Kids, and the world's most creative animation designers to bring you an incredible world where Richard Tyler must conquer his own fears. Hang on, guys! I'm coming! That's it, boy! Go for the desert! The motion picture experience that will open your eyes to all the treasures the imagination can hold. The Page Master. Coming for Christmas 1994. where they make a picture a week. And if it's a good picture, it's a miracle. Action! I'm in the heat and I'm horny as hell. Got the bath. Come on, that's not in the script. The script, I'm being eaten alive. Mary, this is not a film about the human condition. This is a film about kiss and ass. Hollywood Boulevard, where starlets are made. Hi, I'm Candy. You must be an actress. Well, I'm trying to be one. Hello, cold and empty night. Everybody's sleepy. Mm. Well, shall we have a three-way career conference? I was PG, Miracle Pictures. I had a little accident on the set, and uh, they need a replacement in a hurry. A stunt driver? Look, I can't. In this scene, your motivation is to, to be... stay alive. We buried our last stunt girl on Saturday. Good luck, sweetheart. They audition in bed, dodge flying lead, do whatever it takes to get ahead. No. No, no! I want action! Jill, what a performance. Jill? Jill! She's dead, for real! How am I going to get my clothes on? PG, you just don't understand. People are dying. Hey, that's showbiz. <laughs> Hollywood Boulevard brings you Haunted Castle, Skydiving, Water Sports, Future Shock, Axe Murders, Crime in the Streets, Home Food, Green Meatballs, Pink Monsters, Girls in Bikini, Girls Without Bikini, Witty Remarks, Blow It Out Your Ass, Naked yeah. Truth. It's a real low budget picture, you know what I mean? Raw emotion and Commander Cody and his Lost Planet Airmen. Things happen fast on Hollywood Boulevard. Rated R. Cut!
The main attraction. Wow guys. This movie is going to be so awesome as hell. The Loud House movie is better than any movie from this year. Oh hell yeah. I agree with you. This is going to be so awesome. Alright boys, we're about to watch some movie trailers from 1969 to 1975. Well, Kirby, of course. Let's watch some weird previews, buddy. Well, I bet the previews are going to be weird as heck. Kirby, play the trailers, dude. Well, okay then. Here are the weird previews from 1969 to 1975. Just watch. Cameron Mitchell starring in Rebel Rouser. Featuring Academy Award nominee Jack Nicholson of Easy Rider. Co-starring Bruce Dern and Diane Ladd. Men with no conscience, they drifted where the wings of lust carried them. The Rebel Rousers, a pack of ravaging mad wolves, ripped the scar of terror across the face of our nation. They had but one freedom. If it feels good, do it! With the unbridled passion of men possessed, they blasted their way through all opposition in a campaign of sensual self-indulgence that left nothing but burned-out shells of humanity strewn in their path. Offspring of fire pelting machines of destruction, they ripped through life at mind-searing speeds. Hard as steel with the strength of madness, they were fit out of guards to their goddess of evil. Conquerors with no mercy, the rebel rousers laid waste to the flesh and blood of America's waters and destroyed each other in their insane race to nowhere. Cameron Mitchell starring in Rebel Rousers with Bruce Dern and Diane Ladd featuring Jack Nicholson of Easy Rider. A Paragon International picture Eastman color, a four-star Excelsior release rated R. They can't. What time is it? America, 1957. It was howdy duty time and rock and roll was king. You cruising for a bruising son? You want a mouthful of bloody chicklets? And Melvin and the rock and roll rebels were wanted for bank robbery, kidnapping, bigamy, and 57 violations of the traffic code. Crazy mama! Drop those guns, lady! Crazy mama! Rated PG. Get I hope I'm satisfactory. What are you going to be, a smut maker? I'm sorry, Holly. Notice, notice your hair, please. Oh, we're going to make a movie! die. You should have thought of that before, Susie. Before you ripped my son out of you. versus the terrifying Dune Buggy Boys. 
never let those punks get away with that. Look, Bo, if we start trouble with those guys now, the cops are gonna blow us right off the beach. They steal each other's gals, and no woman is safe. Well, now ain't that something. I got something special for you. You can take your something special and show it. They live by a law of their own. What they want, they take. Kill him, kill him. Peter Besser tried to kill me. He's a big mother's mind. Everybody gets suckers! They wreck, they steal, they plunder. Break the rule! are roaring your way in color. This picture is rated up. Jolt of terror with two of America's most blood-chilling science fiction shockers, Island of the Burning Band and Godzilla's Revenge. In this quiet setting, a tale of prehistoric horror is about to unfold with a science-battling awakening of long-gone giants. each other for the conquest of our planet. See the giant spiders spin their web of fear around their enemies. Godzilla's revenge knows no limit. No end. No stopping. See man's last attempt at saving humanity from destruction. And Godzilla's revenge. And on the same shot bill program, Island of the Burning Dam. What is that strange noise and burning white heat that drove people to their death? I have been convinced that this island has become the center of an invasion. The central landing point for beings from another planet. What happens when an unknown power from outer space uses our radar signals as life-saving beacons to bring it to Earth to consume our energy? Island of the Burning Damned, an island desperate for help. Six, the Mexican general Santa Ana captured the Alamo. In 1969, another Mexican general is about to try again. A general who can't lead and an army that won't follow are about to recapture the Alamo in the most hysterical non-war that ever rocked Texas. We're closed! We're closed! Open that gate! The Alamo has fallen, but the fun is just beginning. You're not fooling me, you're working for the Chinese communists! Who? Maybe we could drop leaflets in Spanish, asking them to give themselves up. Leaflets take too long to make. Well, maybe we could get them Xerox. Maybe we could set up some big public address system amplified. Yeah, get someone with sort of a sexy voice, kind of a Alamo rule. Wait a minute. Forget it. I'm Sam Gillison, M.D. Now, don't talk. You just listen to me, Sam. 
It's all beginning to happen just like you said it would. Watch, Doherty. Where are you, Aunt Hetty? Shh! Now listen, Sam. Sam, the Chinese communists have taken over the Alamo. Alamo? Pass out the ammunition. I tried to tell you. You didn't tell me to bring no ammunition. Red for retreat. A red player for retreat. A green player for attack. Have you got that? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. A green player. Yes, sir. Oh, no. Meanwhile, back at the Alamo. <coughs> Salud. Perhaps we should send you home, senorita. No, I'll stay. I must talk to you. I have a special interest in you. This is not the end, but you'll have to see it all to believe it. Some are made. Some are simply mistakes. Take it from me, Jonathan Winters. You must meet Max, the most magnificent mistake of them all. I know you've been going out on me. No old lady of mine goes out on me. I'll never tell you, even if you do kill me. Don't worry, I'm not going to waste you. I'm going to kill you in front of the gang. <laughs> the last time we really raised some hell. The scenes you have just witnessed are from the motion picture, Road of Death. It's a story that had to be told sooner or later. We're telling it now. Now see Carol Connors in Road, Road of, of Death. Death. This exciting motion picture is coming to this theater. See Road of Death. Road, Road of, of Death. death. Road of death. Road of death. Great crap below, sir. Well, what are you nervous about? I don't know how to get you from here to the bedroom. Oh, that's the lousiest approach I've ever heard. I, I don't coax, 
I can't. If you want to go to bed, we go. And if you don't, we don't. Carry me. Carry me into the bedroom. I'd like to be carried, please. The town is Las Vegas. And these are the rules of the game. Take Academy Award winning Elizabeth Taylor as a beautiful loser who always gave more than she got. You don't remember me. I've never met you before in my life until last night. Congratulations. There's not many girls in this town remember every day. What kind of a person are you? Take Warren Beatty as a loser with winning ways and a crazy dream of beating the game just once. You can move in with me if you want to. Both of us free to pull out at any time, no questions asked. Both of us free to pull out at any time, no questions asked. 50-50 on household expenses? 50-50 on household expenses. What's the rent? 175 a month. You just got yourself a roommate. Some enchanted evening you Give them Academy Award winning George Stevens as a director In a stage hit by Pulitzer Prize winning dramatist Frank Gilroy Go away! And you've got a sure winner in the only game in town How would you like a nice warm bath? <laughs> no! Let's grab your back No! Two gallant losers with all the odds against them. Trying to make it together. Hello. Why didn't you phone? I've been phoning for two days. Papa. I've been living with him. Why do we have to get married? I think I'm pregnant. That's your problem. My heart or my heart? It's the only game in town, and we're gonna play it. Wow, guys. These movie previews from 1969 to 1975 were so weird and eerie as heck. Yeah, I agree with you, Cubby. These movie previews from 1969 to 1975 were so weird, you know? Yeah, guys, these movie previews were so weird. This made my ears wiggle and my face grin at the same time. That was so weird and eerie, dude. Yeah, I agree, V. These movie trailers from 1969 to 1975 were so weird and funny. At the same time, you know, these mean mayors wiggle. Yeah, boys, agree with these vintage movie trailers. They're so weird and funny at the same time as well. Yeah, I agree with you guys. These movie previews from 1969 to 1975 were so weird and funny at the same time. Wait a minute, did, did I just uh, throw a door knock? I feel it in my right ear. Well, yeah, I hear the door knock in my right ear as well. Let's go to the door. Why, hello there, Casey. What's the story? Hello, gentlemen. I have something to tell you. Dora and Little Bill are watching the Loud House movie without their permission. What do you think of this story? Well, yeah, I hear the door knock in my right ear as well. Let's go to the door. I'll take a guess. It's Mephiles, Plankton, Mackay Godzilla, King Tyler San, and Kowalter join Dora and Little Bill. Is that right, Casey? Well, I have good ears. What'll do? You're definitely right. Great. So, let's go to Vion Stadium and movie theater, you guys. Come on. So, gentlemen, are you ready to punish Dora and her friends for watching the Loud House movie? Born ready, Casey. Let's go to the ticket manager about this problem. Great. Let's go. Come on, boys. We're getting closer there. Yep. We're here at the ticket manager now, though. Hello. Is there a problem? Oh, yay. There's a problem, Canon Films. Dora, Little Bill, Plankton, K.I.A. Walter, King Tyler San, Me Files, and Mechagodzilla are watching the Loud House movie. Can we please go punish them? Okay then. But for those of you who can wiggle your ears, wiggle them to hear deep to the theater. Thanks, Canon Films! Okay. We're here. 
So, Casey, Sonic Boom, Tails Boom, Mario, Sonic, and Tails, wiggle your ears to hear deep to the theater boys. You got it Pikachu. Come on boys. Let's wiggle our ears to hear deep to the theater. Wiggle them big ears now. So, boys, did you hear anything? Yes, we had it, so let's get inside the cinema right now. Yes, let's do this. Well, kids, the Loud House movie's so many times better than any other movie from 2021. Don't you agree? Yeah, I agree with you, Plankton and friends. <laughs> Holy shit, we're in deep damn trouble. That's right. Guys, how dare you watch the Loud House movie? You know that movie is made by Nickelodeon, and you're banned from stuff made by Nickelodeon. And little Bill, watch your mouth, young boy. Yay! Get outside the theater right now. We are calling your parents. No! Guys, somebody's here to see you. Mechagodzilla, Mephilus, King Tyler San, Gia Walter, and Plankton. Go home right now so we have to deal with Dora and little Bill. Dora, little Bill, how dare you kids watch the Loud House movie while punished? You know that movie is made by Nickelodeon, and you're banned from stuff made by Nickelodeon, Big Idea, Pixar, Sony Pictures Animation, DreamWorks, New Line Cinema, Video Brinkter, Activision, Bisift, and more. That's so it. Yep. You heard what Elena said, you two are so punished and grounded for five weeks. Let's go home right now kids. Ah!